You look like hell. Thanks. Maybe she wants you to go after her. No, she doesn't. Wait a couple of days and go after her. Shut up. I need to try some other version of myself. We'll never get to where we were. Where was that? Someplace good. Um, in the film, was it challenging to not only play your character, but also you had to play the perspective of your character as well? Um, yeah, no, totally. Yeah. In my film, just completely in charge, in the way that one usually is when you're playing a character, you know, you just, you're the, you're the custodian of the, the story of that man and you are uh, in charge of making sure that it's interesting all along the way and all that kind of thing and you do whatever you feel your character would do in order to tell that story. But when you're in her film and you are really just... Uh, the expression of her memory, uh, then it's less important what you think your character would do and more important that you do what she thinks your character would do, you know? So that was quite interesting and quite unique. I've never really experienced that kind of environment as an actor, but it's quite liberating as well because you kind of give yourself over to her and, you know, it doesn't really matter if you think it's the wrong decision. She's the boss. And in my film, I'm the boss. So it's kind of, it's, it's an interesting way to work. And did you have to study her character um, as well, obviously to inform your character? Uh, did I have to study her character? Yeah, so, so you uh, a little to bit. Her well, so a little bit, but I wanted to stay yeah. away from her film as oh, much okay. as possible, and I tried not to read her film because in my film, in in the him version of these two films, we really don't know where she's gone. Um, and for me to kind of study her film too much, I'd just be sort of knowing exactly where she went and, and finding out exactly where she is and what she's doing and why she left and I wanted to, her to remain you know the him film is a mystery it is a where is she not a who done it but it is a where is she and why is she gone and, and I wanted that to be as unanswered in my head as possible you know um, the original film is actually original story. Sorry, it's actually in two films. Um, do you think blending the viewpoints together has altered your initial um, intention for the film? Well, I think those other two films still exist. So this version did alter that intention definitely. But you know, we just opened the other two films in the states. Um, they came out in theaters last week. So you know, I'm really happy that those still exist. Those are the things I started with, and I'm most proud of. But you know, it was a really great experience to sort of. You know, some people will go see a three-hour and ten-minute two-part him and her perspective-based experience, and others will just want to see a two-hour version of the film. And it's up to the audience to choose what they want. You know, I'm happy about that. So. And what is it about subject that interests you? I just think you know that's the beauty of people is that we we all sort of cope in different ways. We all sort of deal with things in different ways and and, and have different personalities. That that sort of I, I just like that. Um, you know that that we deal with things very differently and, and that's there's no right or wrong you know I think it just makes us who we are and that's sort of what I wanted to show through this this film. And also um, um, at the time of writing the story you were in a relationship with Jessica? Weren't you? Yes I was. Yeah, did that inform um, your story in any way? Your script in any yeah way? yeah of course yeah. I mean she she was you know helping me and reading the script and you know like giving me thoughts and you know it was wonderful I mean she's she's aside from us being in a relationship with one of my best friends, you know, we're club creative partners. She's a producer on the film as well, so yeah, it was and did great. Draw on from your experiences. Um, your yeah, a little bit. I mean, you sure yeah. you can't help but draw from your personal experiences with these things, especially on more personal films dealing with subject matter like this. Thank you so much. Yeah, thank, thank you. you.